Beijing says Taiwan has no right to join the United Nations. This post received a score of 11,000, with an up-vote ratio of 94%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. On October 25, 1971, the Republic of China was removed from the United Nations and was replaced by the People's Republic of China. Source. The history is of course relevant, but it was very important that the issue at the UN included a permanent veto-wielding seat on the Security Council. The ROC is not asking for that permanent Security Council seat, but a lesser level of membership, commensurate with a population of 25 million that currently has no representation. It's worth noting that this has a precedent, with both North Korea and South Korea having UN seats, despite both technically claiming the territories of the other. This precedent was set after the fiasco with China, though, so it seems they learned from their mistakes. Greater than North Korea and South Korea having UN seats, which leads the interesting situation of North Korea, a UN member, technically still being at war with the United Nations. They are also the world's only necrocracy state ruled by a dead guy, so this isn't their greatest contradiction. Kim Il-sung is Asia's strongest power lich. Of course Beijing would say that. Personally I hope that Taiwan does join the UN and then gets to sign up every Western nation as a political and military ally. That would change the status quo that both the US and China agreed to in the 1970s, and essentially induce China to declare it a breach and invade Taiwan. They've been threatening to invade Taiwan for decades. All we see are threats. It is time that the world's nations recognize Taiwan for the independent, productive and democratic nation that it appears to be. This is an issue the people of Taiwan should decide. The people of Taiwan overwhelmingly prefer maintaining the status quo. Pretty straightforward. Taiwan's government is the one that has been pursuing UN membership. Specifically, they've recently been seeking WHO and UNFCCC membership. Taiwan is the one that should be sitting on the Security Council actually oops we had their address wrong all this time. Taiwan was actually on the Security Council until 1971. Not Taiwan. ROC held the seat as the legitimate ruler of China when it ruled mainland China, until PROC gained international recognition as the ruler of China, thus replacing ROC in the UN. After the Japanese colonization of Taiwan ended with the end of WW2, the Kuomintang lost the civil war and retreated to Taiwan. Ever since the KMT retreated to Taiwan, the Republic of China has unfortunately become synonymous with Taiwan. Republic of China equals Taiwan is unfortunately how the world sees Taiwan due to the history. The Republic of China however does not equal Taiwan as no one cares about retaking the mainland and Taiwan does not care about being the real China. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.